and the Mexican flag in the other. They're the only brothers currently holding boxing. No, that's not me. That's you. The championship, George. That Scouts. is overcome all of his... See a guy come into his hometown smiling so much before a fight. De La Hoya can do to top it. De La Hoya. Solid right hand to begin round one. No. Set up everything behind a jab. Then throw numbers. Oscar is naturally left-handed, but fights from a right-handed stance. It's the lightweight inverse of Michael Moore is also his strongest and best hand. And he finishes every combination, if he can, with a left hook. It's probably his most dangerous punch. The younger guys, when they are good punches, have a tendency to taste the guy's power. Oh, look at the grin from De La Hoya as he drops in the ring with Oscar. Oscar is a great finisher. This could be over fast. No action in return from Vidal as De La He knows that 12 rounds. He faced killer. Believe me, if Oscar wins this title, the WBO will suddenly be the place. There's evidence that his managers were disappointed if he doesn't produce a first round. Yeah. Early in the round, left himself open and put. It was more of a flash knockdown. He was complete. Oscar started back to the body, which was great. King at the beginning of round two is about as good an omen as you could look for. He was hurt there. in his last fight, October 30. Oscar's got to remember, he got that flash knockdown when pressing him. He didn't get it by head to the side. Good just got to allow him to come forward a little bit to be at more accurate with that shot. De La Hoya backing him up with the jab. Now the best thing has happened, Oscar's starting to use his left jab. Boy, he is strong for this weight, George. He thinks he's fought better fighters than uh, Oscar De La Hoya, although the list of he's opponents hurt. is he's a in anonymity. Yep. Here we go. Redal down again. Round two. Oscar's got to be patient. Set this thing back up. Three knockdown rule is... Sal George. That's the only way you can ensure that the guy doesn't have his power left in a lot of rounds. And the final flow. It appeared to be the first left hand, followed by that last right hand. It all. As you can see, shades of Sugar Ray Leonard seated in the front row at ringside. Riedel trying to be more assertive as round three begins. He's been knocked down in each of the first two rounds. Tasted the best power that Oscar has. But his confidence can do nothing but grow now. And landed for Vidal. Just misses with the right. This time I'm tricking, tricking. Right hand landed for Vidal. Body punt. Didn't quite get there. Slapping with the left, but now a hard right hand and into the rope. Good left hook. Yeah, and he's deteriorated to one punch at a time. Combinations only. There. Interestingly, Bridal had promised us a lot of body punching, saying that he didn't think De La Hoya had proved himself as one who could take it to the ribcage yet. Much because he's been defending himself too much, George. That's right. He's got to start jabbing. Just keep your lead. Walking forward sometimes. The right foot is bumping into his left foot, crossing over once. Another left hand gets in just under the chin. Oscar's defense at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Don't walk into it. There's some serious self-defense. He set himself up again. I think this guy's just not going down right. Frustrating for piling up a lead on the scorecard. It's never been farther than eight rounds. Ridal has gone past ten rounds three times. Good body shots from De La Hoya. Open him up quite so quickly. 
can push you to do things that you ought not to do. Oh, remember Holyfield getting in trouble in Atlanta again. Four rounds. Our punch stat numbers tell us that De La Hoya. Right hand got up underneath De La Hoya's guard. Bridal working hard to try to follow up with the left hand. Missing wildly, but Oscar knows he's in there. Hold it, hold it, hold it. And they're outraged when he refuses to do it. Great He's not fighting like a guy who really wants to win, keep his title. Telegraphing his body punches, huh? <laughs> you can get that for your wife, Joan. Yeah. It's okay. The 130-pound world championships are Hell Hernandez, Azuma Nelson, and John John Molina. As you watch De La Hoya go to work again to try to finish Fridal. There's blood from Fridal's nose. He's chasing Fridal. Is he doing a good enough job of cutting off the ring? He's following him. But he's bouncing along. Cutting off the ring deal is one of the hardest things for a young fighter to learn and remember. Right? The ring a small place. When you let a guy circle the whole ring, you've missed the boat. Parenthetical observation, gentlemen, from the dressing ripple from the knock. Knock out. Close enough now to give him some opportunities. He knew he took to the body. His confidence seeming to return gradually, but... Right, left. No, you throw three punches, he got a ring. Compliment a fighter who is who is losing heartbeats within this massive body of this is left jab. There's no contact. Delahoy is gonna hit you in the body, he looks there first. Left hand landed inside for Delahoy. <laughs> up left hook left hook sometimes it gets awful frustrating especially this is a softball so that punch to the you're doing everything you can and you can't get a knockout you're young you think everybody's supposed to fall he's having to keep order in that room he, uh, he it, wouldn't have been, it was a foul right it wouldn't have been a right hand though his body is on the wall. Oh. Too late then. De La Hoya inciting a near sellout in the new Grand Olympic since 1925, the beating heart of boxing on the West Coast. The way they move in synchrony. It's the first time he's ever had to go which is in the round. In the San Bernardino Mountains, his friends and trainer Robert Alcazar. Right hand, not to take his body forward. He could get cut. And then left, left hander's head is get a bad cut. As James Tony, bleeding badly from a cut over his left on Littles, rallied to score. The distance with this opponent apparently. Keep him working hard. What did I just say? <laughs> of the fight, the others came in rounds one and two. Fridal looks utterly weary. And referee Lou Moret has to be thinking stoppage pretty soon if De La Hoya continues this onslaught. Hold it, hold it. Coming into the fight. Oscar hit, lands one shot and throws four. Now, cut off the ring. Keep him here in the corner. Four. But then a lot of it is because he's very good at circling. <laughs> <laughs> That's the truth. Thirty seconds left in round ten. How Are you okay? <laughs> Five, five, five. 
pneumonia, either the referee or the doctor can That's stop it. the fight. And the doctor here says, enough. And you know what? Ridal doesn't entirely disagree. So, which, um, which end of the fight, really? Tell us what you see. I was just putting a lot of pressure to him. He couldn't just stand the pressure because uh, I, I felt bad. Now, now this is the end of the fight. Did you punch enough to the body in this fight, Oscar? 